Hey everybody, this is a demo on the Intune macOS experience. So we're going to hit this Enroll My Mac button, which is going to download the client. And we're going to go ahead and install it. So the company portal has been installed. Let's see what happens next. So it doesn't look like it ever actually launched for us. I'll just open it, which is fine. Just something to take note, how it doesn't seem to launch on its own. So I'm going to click sign in. It's going to ask me to pick my account. So I'll pick my account. Now it's going to try to enroll. So we're going to hit begin. We're set up Centrex access. See here, it is a pretty nice experience from a user perspective. So as what you can see, what you can't see, which is great. So now we're going to download this profile. Say overall, it's pretty clean, which is always a really good thing. I'm going to allow notifications. So right now it's installing my management profile. Install. So that's all squared away. It's installing all my profiles. See, I've created some base profiles. Fortunately, it's making me. You can see that that's an Intune agent. We'll close this profile section. Says we're all set. Hit done. It's nice once wants to know what categories. I've created some categories. We'll hit Boston, hit done. Which is certainly a good thing. You see it shows my Mac. It says my device is in compliance when it last checked. It does not show any apps yet. You see a couple of nice little fun things. There's change password. Let's see what that does. It's pretty neat. It takes me to the Azure AD password change functionality, which we certainly like. But yeah, overall, relatively clean experience. We still don't see any of our apps yet. I'm sure it'll be coming in as the device checks in. One thing we do we do notice a lot with Intune is that stuff does take a little bit longer than we'd like it to. But that's all right. Thanks and have a good day.